Ya llegamos, papi chulo. Ya llegamos, papi chulo. Ya llegamos. Woo, ya llegamos, papi chulo. Ya llegamos. Ties had been like falling. Like he's gonna fall asleep since we left the house. And I was like, okay, if he, if he falls asleep close to the house, it's fine. Y empezó a cerrar los ojos right when I pulled to the parking lot. So I'm like, ya llegamos. Ya nos vamos a bajar. No les pasa. As soon as you get to where you're going, your babies fall asleep. And you're like, Wait, please wait. Let me find parking pa. En cuanto encontremos estacionamiento nos bajamos. Una, dos. Back to Costco. We need diapers. Stat. I came by myself with the baby, so... Jenny se quedó en la casa. Espérame, please, because this parking is not even tight. I just don't know how to park. Okay, we're here, baby. Okay, let me get my stuff. Keys, ID. I lost my Costco card, so I'm going to have to go into the... You know the place, like their little office, to get a temporary one? Yes. Vamos pa. Vamos. Vamos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're officially in. Aquí está el Santiago. I don't know why it took so long with the membership line. I asked them if they can put it on my phone because... Uh -huh. Now you don't have to have the... Fi Ooh. You don't have to have the physical card anymore. But I don't know why I'm having trouble connecting my email to it. And I literally don't even carry a wallet anymore. Um, he gave me a day pass and he told me to try again in five minutes. A ver si funciona. But we're in here now. No se dormir Santiago, even though I could tell he's sleepy. Mira pa, ¿qué es eso? Look at this. ¿Qué es eso? Wow. They have all the summer stuff here. So, vamos a caminar un ratito. Because it's been a long time since I've came to Costco like without being in a rush. Pero ya sé lo que vengo y nomás eso vamos a comprar. Yay. We walked through the whole food section, but honestly right now estoy en el modo sacar todo so we didn't get anything. So it looks like we're just gonna take exactly what we need. We came a viejito hour because all the viejitos are here right now. It's nice and early. What do you think, SJ? One of you guys actually recommended <laughs> recommended this seasoning to me, so we might have to try it. A ver qué tiene. Sea salt, garlic, onion. No lo pongas en la boca. Lemon peel, mustard seed, chili pepper, y otras cosas. We'll try it. We'll try it. Lo que veníamos. Diapers for you, sir. Vienen 198, so duran un chorro. Yes, sir. This is for you. Yes, sir. Es tuyo. Y sí, ya tiene hambre. Also, I found these. My mom recommended these to me. Supuestamente nomás no tiene no sugar added. It's just fruit. Okay. And he likes them. <laughs> Ten. Ten. Okay. Vámonos. Ahora sí. Okay, we're done. It was nice and quick. Ahorita se va a dormir en el carro, yo creo. Just got home. SJ took a nap. And you guys. I have been in my decluttering phase. Let me tell you. So we went to Klaus' house this last weekend. Traigo los días todos volteados. But we went to Klaus' house this last weekend and I was super inspired, you guys, because her house is literally like an Airbnb. I didn't really show you guys like detail, like, oh, this is her living room and this is that. But she lives like a very minimalist lifestyle and I love it because basically she was like, yeah, like, no batallo mucho limpiando porque pues no tengo muchas cosas. And then entre menos cosas tengas, menos cosas limpias. So it just like really, really inspired me because I'm like, I feel like there's always a lot in our house. Like, if I show you guys right now, like, look, these are our water jugs that never made it all the way in. We have some extra shoes right here. Then, oh, actually, these are my roller plates. <laughs> my crocs and my inside shoes so that's on me we have this is the mess that i made this morning when we were having breakfast i already started the cluttering so i have some things sitting outside that need to be put away and stuff but hola buenos dias santiago so for example i took this from at the under the sink these are all cleaning products that we've had for over a year but we don't use them so i'm like los voy a regalar a alguien que si los ocupa because like we literally we don't use them and look this is the under the sink now. It looks a lot more organized so, so and a lot better and a lot less crowded, right? So that we have to give it away to somebody. Hola. Hola. I'm doing laundry and doing laundry. 
We're still doing laundry from the trip. Bro, look, my man just took pack. Literally, okay, let me tell you guys something. I took off the baby playpen or, you know, I had Denny take it out from here. And I was like, we're gonna have this big open space. It's gonna look so good. It literally took less than two hours and look, we already put his stuff here. I'm washing, I'm washing. <laughs> See? <laughs> Denny's washing takes seven business days, so. <laughs> By the time he finishes washing, ya empieza otra vez el ciclo. So, my goal is to clear everything out. These are some of the stuff. I'm going to be donating these blankets. This is some baby clothes that needs to be donated as well because he doesn't, he grew out of it really fast. Look, I already got these cajones done. So, this is going to be the medicine cabinet, as you can see. This is all the baby stuff. Here we have some regular medicines i want to clear everything i want to walk in here and i want it to look like it's an airbnb okay. i'm inspired by clau i want our house to look like clau's house that's funny oh you can give me trash look I did not give you that. I know you're lying right now. Todo me echa la culpa el Denny. So let's get started. Let's get clean, girl. You didn't pass a test. together and basically what he does is he puts SJ here and he like basically helps him to walk and I'm like you're literally making him grow way too fast <laughs> you are too tiny to be walk I mean and el nombre de Jesus I don't want to stop him from anything but Danny's the same person who taught him how to crawl and now he's teaching him how to walk <laughs> and it's just going way too fast it's going way too fast for this mom this mama cannot handle it it's the most bittersweet feeling ever because you're so proud but you're sad. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Mente. Oh my goodness. Oh. oh. What's your next move, my guy? All done? Mente. It's so, dude, he's fast now. It's so, it's so. I'm gonna start the cluttering. Woo! <laughs> we finally turned him. But one thing, okay, the first step is you accepted it. That makes me very happy. No, I don't have a problem. Yeah, 
<laughs> you don't have a problem? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> He's just standing there? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> ¿Qué hace chaparrito? <laughs> we turn around and he's just standing there. So you're finally admitting you have a problem. No, I don't have a problem. What do you mean, my boy? <laughs> okay, okay. He doesn't have a problem. So you're gonna, you're finally gonna start decluttering. I'm, 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 gonna, I'm gonna get rid of everything. Everything? And, and I'm just gonna buy new stuff. I don't think that's how it works. No, no, no. That's not how it works. You're just gonna get rid of things that you haven't used. Okay. Or things that no longer, like, Fail your, fit your lifestyle, fit you, like it's just... Everything fits you now, so. I know everything fits you, skinny queen, but... <laughs> but just things you don't use anymore because you don't dress like how you used to in 2012. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, what's up again? Do you see how I'm going to get? Oh, this is the Santiago. Danny said that he's going to have a keep pile, keep pile, donate, and throw away. Let's cross our fingers. Pen? What did you say? Thank God. I want my new one. Nah. Bro, what in the 2012 is going on with those pants, baby? You're a jerk, I know. I'm so happy to see those pants go, but I won't believe it till they're gone and out of this house. You know? I'm gonna buy new pants. Baby, esos ya salieron de moda. I'm so happy this had to be documented because those pants are the most hideous thing I've ever seen in my life. Um, I'm serious. You keep telling me. Nah, I've never said that about those pants. Morning. It's the next day. Anoche el Santiago se quedó jugando. Girl, it's in una rachita where he's waking up in the middle of the night again. So let's pick up his toys. Mom life. <laughs> How many times have I picked up this living room and this kitchen? The answer is yes. Um, SJ and Denny went to go get gas for the car. So I'm here to close off this vlog and finish cleaning up. So let me show you guys. This is the clothes that Denny ended up donating. It's not a very big pile, but I'm, I am really, really proud of him because if you've never decluttered before, if you've never donated clothes before, it is really hard to let go of sentimental things. And I totally understand that, which is why I don't pressure him. I don't rush him. I don't ever tell him like, we need to get rid of everything in your house because I know that holding on to physical things is more of like an emotional thing for a lot of people. So I never really want to rush him. And thankfully he is very respectful. The majority of the space and i think that when you move in with someone i mean this is just like everybody who's married or lives with somebody will understand when you move in with someone who's very different from you because obviously you come from different upbringings you come from different backgrounds you kind of have to mesh things together so that you can meet somewhere in the middle so in my opinion it would be completely unacceptable for me to be like you need to get rid of all your things and i'm gonna throw everything away that's like yours and that's out of place because that would be like him telling me, I'm just gonna leave everything everywhere. And if you wanna clean all the time, that's not my problem, you know? So marriage or long-term relationships are a lot of compromise. So I am very proud of the steps that he's made. So look, we got rid of all the clothes that were here on the ground. He still needs to put these things away. Um, that maleta goes in the back. This is some dirty clothes. I need to put this clothes away right now. More than anything, I'm just happy that he's willing to work with me because obviously I think I'm the pickier one or the more like, I'm the one that's more like, oh, we need to have the house a certain way. And in my opinion, like if you're not that way, it is pretty annoying when people are like following behind you, telling you like, you need to do this and you need to do that. So I'm very appreciative, appreciative of the fact that he's very supportive of keeping a clean house. I love that for us. Vamos a tener visita sometime soon. We're gonna have very special guests staying here at the house so we're gonna keep the cluttering and we're gonna keep we're gonna keep the cluttering and we're gonna keep organizing and we're gonna keep getting rid of things that we don't need because i'm so excited that i'm actually that we're actually gonna be hosting somebody for the first time is it the first time we're hosting people no it's not the first time we're hosting people but it is the first time where I don't know, it's just, I love receiving guests. I'm not very good at hosting, so please do not think that I'm like an expert host, but I would like to say that I love to have people over at my house and I would I love to share what little we have with our, with our friends and family and it just feels good to receive people in your house. Also, if you guys wanna guess 
who is coming over in the comments, please let me know. I really don't think you guys are gonna guess. My guess is that you're not gonna guess, but if anyone guesses, if anyone guesses, leave your comment with the cash app down below. I mean, leave a comment with who you think is coming over with your cash app and the first person to guess wins. And I'm gonna send you guys $50. So make sure you leave your guess with your cash app.